Monica Bellucci and Tim Burton, two names that have long been synonymous with excellence in their respective fields. These names resonate within their respective spheres, each carving out a niche that has left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. Monica Bellucci, the Italian screen siren, known for her captivating beauty and powerful performances, has enchanted audiences worldwide. Her journey from a small town girl in Città di Castello to an international icon is nothing short of inspiring. Tim Burton, the visionary American filmmaker, celebrated for his whimsical, dark, and utterly unique cinematic style, has redefined the boundaries of storytelling. His films are a testament to his boundless imagination and his ability to create worlds that are both fantastical and deeply human. Until recently, their paths seemed destined to remain parallel, each a luminary in their own right, shining brightly in their respective galaxies. Monica, with her ethereal beauty and magnetic screen presence, and Tim, with his unparalleled creativity and distinctive directorial voice. Yet, fate, it seems, had other plans. In a world where the unexpected often becomes reality, their paths crossed in the most serendipitous of ways. In a twist worthy of a Burton film, the two found love in the most unexpected of places, sending ripples of surprise and delight through the worlds of film and fashion. Their union was a revelation, a beautiful surprise that no one saw coming. Their relationship quickly became a testament to the idea that love can blossom even in the unlikeliest of circumstances. It was a reminder that sometimes the most magical stories are the ones that unfold in real life. Monica, with her illustrious career spanning decades and continents, has graced countless magazine covers and starred in critically acclaimed films like Milena and Irreversible. Her performances have been lauded for their depth and intensity, earning her a place among the greats of cinema. Tim, the mastermind behind cinematic gems like Edward Scissorhands and The Nightmare Before Christmas, continues to captivate audiences with his dark humor and fantastical storytelling. His films are not just movies, they are experiences that transport viewers to otherworldly realms. Their individual achievements are impressive enough, but together, they form a fascinating tableau of talent, creativity, and undeniable allure. Their partnership is a blend of Monica's timeless elegance and Tim's eccentric genius, creating a dynamic that is both intriguing and inspiring. Theirs is a love story capturing the imagination, prompting whispers of shared passions and artistic synergy. Fans and critics alike are eager to see how their relationship will influence their work and what new heights they might reach together. The world watches with bated breath, curious to see how their unique energies intertwine and what creative endeavors might emerge from their newfound connection. Will they collaborate on a project that combines their distinct styles? Only time will tell, but one thing is certain. The union of Monica Bellucci and Tim Burton is a story that will continue to captivate and inspire for years to come. The seeds of their romance, though slow to bloom, were planted long before their paths officially intertwined. It was a time when the world was a different place, and the magic of cinema brought people together in ways that transcended borders and languages. In 2006, during the bustling atmosphere of the Cannes Film Festival, Monica and Tim first crossed paths. The festival, known for its glitz and glamour, was a melting pot of creativity, where filmmakers, actors, and enthusiasts from around the globe gathered to celebrate the art of cinema. The French Riviera, with its air of glamour and cinematic celebration, served as the backdrop for their initial meeting. The azure waters and sun-kissed beaches provided a picturesque setting, adding to the allure of the festival. It was a place where dreams were born and stories came to life. Imagine the scene, the iconic red carpet, a sea of flashing cameras, and amidst the orchestrated chaos, two figures, drawn to each other as if by some unseen force. The air was electric with anticipation, as celebrities and filmmakers made their way down the carpet, each step a testament to their hard work and dedication. He, likely clad in his signature black attire, a quiet observer amidst the throngs of people. Tim Burton, with his distinctive style and enigmatic presence, was a figure who commanded attention without seeking it. His films, known for their dark whimsy and imaginative storytelling, had already made him a legend in the industry. She, radiating elegance in a flowing gown, a captivating presence impossible to ignore. Monica Bellucci, with her timeless beauty and grace, was a vision on the red carpet. Her performances had captivated audiences worldwide, 
and her presence at the festival was a testament to her status as a cinematic icon. Their encounter was brief, a fleeting moment of connection amidst the whirlwind of the festival. In the midst of the flashing cameras and the buzz of excitement, their paths crossed, if only for a moment. It was a chance meeting, one that neither of them could have anticipated, yet it left a lasting impression. They exchanged pleasantries, perhaps discussed their shared love for cinema, their words lost to the clamor around them. In that brief conversation, they found common ground, a shared passion for the art form that had brought them both to this place. It was a connection that went beyond words, a meeting of minds and hearts. Little did they know that this seemingly insignificant interaction would, years later, blossom into something far deeper and more profound. At that moment, they were simply two individuals, each on their own journey, unaware of the future that awaited them. But the seed had been planted, and it would only be a matter of time before it began to grow. This first meeting, though fleeting, left an imprint on their memories. It was a moment that would stay with them, a reminder of the magic of that night and the connection they had felt. Even as they went their separate ways, the memory of that encounter lingered, a spark that would one day ignite into something more. Whether it was a shared glance, a spark of recognition in each other's eyes, or simply the undeniable magnetism of two creative forces sharing a space, something resonated between them that day. It was a moment of serendipity, a chance encounter that would set the stage for a future filled with possibilities. The seed was planted, lying dormant for years, waiting for the right conditions to sprout into something extraordinary. And as the years passed, that seed would grow, nurtured by their shared experiences and the bond that had begun to form on that fateful night in Cannes. Their story was just beginning, a tale of love and creativity that would unfold in ways they could never have imagined. Fast forward 16 years and the City of Lights played Cupid for Monica and Tim. Paris, with its timeless charm and romantic allure, set the stage for a love story that would span continents and decades. The city, known for its art, culture, and history, became the backdrop for a tale that was as enchanting as the city itself. It was during the Lumiere Film Festival in Lyon, a celebration of cinematic history and artistry, that their paths converged once again. The festival, renowned for its homage to the art of filmmaking, attracted luminaries from around the world. Among them were Monica Bellucci, the epitome of Italian elegance, and Tim Burton, the maestro of Gothic fantasy. Their presence at the festival was a testament to their enduring influence in the world of cinema. October 2022 became a pivotal month in their love story, marking the moment their connection transcended the realm of casual acquaintance and blossomed into something deeper. The crisp autumn air, the golden leaves and the historic charm of Lyon provided the perfect setting for their rekindled romance. It was as if the universe had conspired to bring them together at this precise moment in time. Imagine the scene, the crisp autumn air, the golden leaves carpeting the cobblestone streets, and amidst the charming ambiance of Lyon, two souls reconnecting, their shared history adding a layer of warmth to their encounter. The city, with its rich tapestry of history and culture, seemed to embrace them, offering a sanctuary where they could rediscover each other. Every corner of Lyon, from its quaint cafes to its majestic cathedrals, echoed with the whispers of their burgeoning love. This time, it was different. The years melted away, replaced by a renewed sense of familiarity and a shared appreciation for the journey that had led them both back to this point. Their eyes, once filled with the curiosity of strangers, now held the depth of shared experiences and mutual respect. The bond they had formed years ago had matured, evolving into a connection that was both profound and enduring. Conversations flowed effortlessly, revealing a deeper connection, a meeting of minds that transcended their initial encounter years ago. They spoke of their passions, their dreams, and the paths they had taken. Each word, each gesture, was a testament to the bond they shared, it was as if they had found in each other a kindred spirit, someone who understood the intricacies of their world and the nuances of their craft. The festival, with its celebration of film, provided the perfect backdrop for their rekindled connection. The magic of cinema, with its ability to transcend time and space, mirrored the magic of their relationship. As they attended screenings and participated in discussions, they found themselves drawn closer together, united by their shared love for the art of storytelling. 
It was as if the spirit of cinema itself conspired to bring them together, their shared passion for storytelling serving as a bridge between their worlds. The films they watched, the stories they discussed, all seemed to reflect their own journey. Each frame, each scene, was a reminder of the power of love and the beauty of human connection. Walks along the banks of the Saoni River, intimate dinners discussing their craft, and laughter echoing through the charming cafes of Lyon. Their time in France was a whirlwind of rediscovering each other and nurturing a bond that had been lying dormant for far too long. The city, with its romantic ambiance and